Hi everyone, Matt Stewart here with Cole Banker, Ronan Realty, here to go over the market stats for November of 2022. As you can see, we're nearing Christmas, we're nearing the end of the year, and what a year it's been, honestly. Some ups and downs, some goods and bads, obviously sellers were winning at the start of the year, buyers are winning at the end. But we're going to dive into the numbers, take a look at everything, see what each market's doing individually on a month over month basis. I'm going to be releasing another video in the next coming weeks here showing you the year over year comparison just so you can get a recap and see what the years have done. So, and at the very end, I'm gonna do my takeaway and then what my predictions are, I think for the next probably like 60 to 90 days, just so you can kind of get a gauge on what I think the market's gonna be. Again, don't have a crystal ball, but I'll give you my educated opinion based on all the statistics. So let's dive into the numbers. As we take a look at the Blue Mountains market, now keep in mind the numbers on this, they're gonna seem inflated. There are bigger properties that sell, so it does have a big impact and we're definitely gonna see that in the numbers. The average price in October for Blue Mountains was 906000 We saw that number jump up by 100% this month as it's sitting at 1816000 Again, keep in mind, there was likely some bigger homes that sold, jumping the price up. We saw 69 new listings in October. We only saw 47 in November. And then we saw 20 sales in October and 21 in November. Again, it's a four season market there. So as we get into the ski season, sometimes you see a bump up in terms of sales, but again, the inventory levels are continuing to pull back a little bit this time of year. But again, hey, if you're in the Blue Mountains area, your average price went up 100% in a month over month basis, so you're doing really well. Just keep in mind those numbers can be a little inflated, but the market seems to be doing really well in the Blue Mountains area. All right, guys, that's the market stats for November of 2022. Thank you for tuning in. I'm gonna do my takeaway now, what I think probably over the next 30 to, 30 to 90 days is what's gonna happen. So in January, we do have another rate increase. So save the date, just like we've done the rest of the year. I'll be doing a video for that, announcing what kind of happens and how it's going to affect you. But I think with that rate increase, we're gonna see prices still dip a little bit more on a month over month basis. But I think we're getting near to the bottom there. So if you're a buyer in this market, I think in the next probably 90 days is going to be your window to lock in, find a property, purchase at a great price, because we are going to see some pent up demand that's going to come through probably in 2024. Again, no crystal ball here, but I think that's what's going to happen because we're still in a housing shortage and we have more inventory, but we still have enough inventory. So keep those things in mind. Next 90 days, we're going to see prices dip a little bit. Great opportunity for buyers, sellers, if you're looking at upgrading, it's also gonna be your time to sell. There's gonna be buyers out there looking for deals and that, but there's also gonna be deals available to you as we see interest rates jump up and they are gonna affect people. So buyers and sellers, there's gonna be windows opportunity for both of you. So that's my takeaway. That's what I think the next kind of 60 to 90 days is gonna bring for buyers and sellers. So if you have any questions, all my details are below. If you wanna book a chat with me, there's a link below for that. Take care guys, have a Merry Christmas and Happy New Year.